seconds to air, people. I'll never forget the day I took over as producer of this broadcast. I walked into the studio and saw something remarkable. Five, four, and now, Catherine Ford and Kent Dickinson. Welcome to Newscast Tonight. In our top story, the mayor issues a proclamation. Mayor, mayor Schultz said... Mayor, mayor... Mayor Schultz said today... I mean, you here was a group of enormously talented people, but they just weren't... Camera one, pan we left. The weather coming up next. Camera one. There's a cat in a tree. Camera one. I'll get the other details. Thank you for calling. Our ace investigative reporter wasn't getting the best shot at the big stories. We now go live on the scene with our reporter, Leslie N. Well, Kent, by the time we got here, the crowd was pretty thick and we can't get through. Can you describe what you're seeing? What I'm seeing? A bunch of backs, some legs, backs of heads. And our very gifted interviewer was, frankly, okay. underutilized. We're pleased to have tonight Tom Cruise's co-star, Leonard Schilling. Uh, I don't know about co-star. Oh, you're awfully modest. The studio says you play an important scene with Tom. Well, it, it's a crowd scene, and, uh, you know, it, it look really quickly to see me. You might miss me. <laughs> Hi, Mom. We run in a competitive news market, and I immediately saw how we could improve our ratings. It was time to gather the team. You know, this is a great organization. But to stay great in this changing market, we've got to increase our productivity, do things more effectively, improve our process. Process isn't just about each of us doing our job better. It's about all of us working together better to achieve our biggest goals. What is our biggest goal? A better newscast. Which means? More viewers, better ratings. Exactly. So that's where we start. With our audience, our customers. What do they want? I asked Gene to make a list of what viewers most like and dislike based on calls and emails. Well, they like Catherine's hair and they dislike Kent's ties. Anything else? Overall, I'd say our viewers want faster coverage of breaking stories and more celebrity interviews. Okay, that's our core. Those are things that directly affect our ratings. We need to deliver better value in our core and find smart new ways to do it. That's where to put more of our energy and resources. Um. In my own defense, I wouldn't be late to those stories if people gave me the news tips when they came in. Look, when Joe's out, all the calls get routed to me. It's bad enough I'm taking them when I'm busy. I can't always be calling you, too. Well, no one has time. I could set up better interviews if I didn't spend hours a day doing things like marking up scripts so Kent and I don't step, step on, on each, each other's lines. lines. Mason, you know, you talk about putting more resources in the core. We don't have any resources to spare. What's so funny? This is great. All these things you're talking about, from handling the news leads, camera and editing, all the things we do to support the broadcast, that's called context. It's critical to our mission, but if we can find ways to streamline and standardize the context, that'll free us up to really innovate in the core. I could see they weren't yet on board. They were still learning about process. I told them about DMAIC, a five-step approach for improving processes. We used DMAIC to rework and standardize the way we process news tips. Now, whenever a tip comes into the station, it's immediately posted to the web and the reporter is paged automatically. Leslie's team is like a race crew now. Twice this week, they've gotten to the scene before any other station. The writers and anchors used DMAIC to improve the scripting process. They devised a color code so each anchor knows instantly which lines to read. Now, even with fast-breaking stories, they're ready for air at a moment's notice. There's a fire breaking out downtown. And now Catherine's got more time to focus on things like getting better interviews. Joining us today is one of the biggest stars of our generation. She actually landed Harrison Ford, but he canceled five minutes before air. Harrison, it's amazing. You look just like our floor director, Gene. Our ratings are up because viewers know they can count on us for the things they care about. And by streamlining the context, we've got the resources to create new core, like a series on internet crime that's bringing in even more viewers. These infected computers worldwide. This used to be a place of individual stars. The way we work together now, we're like a whole constellation. And on a final note, the Television Viewer Awards were presented last night. Voted by you viewers, the award for best newscast went to... You tell them. Us.